Okay, what's up, y'all? Girl Ashley, and I'm back one more again. Um, I'm gonna try to make this quick, but y'all are already know. <laughs> um, this is my wrap up video to my Flab to Fab October challenge. Um, just wants to come in really quickly and just let you guys know how I did for the last week and then kind of my take on the whole month of October. Um, so let's see for the numbers when I started out. Um, in my very first video for this challenge, I was 210.8, I think. Um, my scale, <laughs> y'all, it just done lost it. I really think I need a new battery, but even before the battery started going out, it was kind of trippy. So, I would try and use the scale at the gym, but last time I set up the scale at the gym, it was, um, 207.5. <laughs> um my goal for this month was eight pounds as i said in the first video and clearly i didn't reach the eight pounds but i did lose some um last week's video i kind of talked about how i feel like i was reaching a plateau and i still think that's kind of the issue so um been trying to kind of change it up as much as i can and kind of alter my eating as well so i can kind of get over this hump and continue but um i'm really like I said before, not trying to let it discourage me because I am losing. I haven't gained, so <laughs> that's always good, right? Um, but yeah, this week was pretty good. I worked out three times this week. Um, and then today's actually Thursday. So I did Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Um, I tell you guys, sometimes I try and go Saturday if I can, but I won't be able to this Saturday. I have like meetings and other things to do, so... Won't be able to do it Saturday, but um, three times this week. I will say that my eating hasn't been, um, I think I kind of touched on that before. My lunches haven't been as on point as they could be. Um, like for before, for a while, I was kind of strictly doing like my lean cuisines and uh, my stofers, my little meals, you know. But more and more, I've been kind of eating out. I don't really pig out, but I still think it makes a difference um, as far as loss is concerned. But I didn't have any major setbacks. The only thing that really got me probably this week and some of last week was Halloween. I didn't go trick-or-treating or anything, but my coworkers had candy in the office. It seemed like everywhere I went, it was Halloween candy. <laughs> so I kind of psyched myself out like, oh, it's only the fun size, but, you know, still. So I think there, I kind of, you know, I indulged a bit on the Halloween candy. I ain't going to lie. But other than that, no real major setbacks as far as food is concerned. Just trying to, like I said, maintain my portions um, like I have been doing before. Trying to keep my meals as balanced as possible. Um, still been drinking, you know, plenty of water, tea. Um, every now and then I'll have, you know, something different like juice or very rarely a soda. But for the most part, it's water and tea. Um... Let's see what else. I did get back on my protein shakes. Now, that was one of the things that I mentioned um, way, way back in the summertime when I did my You Are What You Eat video. Talked about my um, Kellogg's protein shakes. Let me turn this fan on. Hold on. I talked about my protein shakes um, and how they would help kind of supplement me throughout the day. Um, and I would drink those and they would kind of, you know, put something on my stomach without me having to reach for you know, some crazy snack that I didn't need. And I really kind of felt falling off of those. But I actually, when I went to the grocery store last week, bought some more of those. So I was drinking those some this week as well. Um, and they are definitely helpful. Um, it's just kind of in between meals, kind of snack type thing to tide you over without, you know, reaching for <laughs> candy like I did some of the time or, you know, chips or whatever. So that is that. Um... But I say for the most part, this week was pretty good. For the challenge, I think I, mean, I am proud because I did lose. Like I said, I'm trying not to let it discourage me. And for the most part, I'm cool. But it is kind of just like, dang. Like, you know what I mean? Like the pounds is not dropping like they were before. But I, I do kind of think it's something to that muscle thing that I am gaining some muscle. Because I'm continuing to feel a difference in the way my clothes fit. And... Um, just the way my body feels in general even though the pounds aren't coming off as rapidly as they were before um so i have gone in a couple stores and i have been wearing 15s when i have 15s lord have mercy i'm a junior not 14s um 
and like I said largest some extra large just depending on what um it is and how it fits but 14 for the most part I can definitely tell the difference in my clothes um this week was the first time that it's gotten really cold here it probably wouldn't be cold so a lot of y'all standards some of y'all in the northeast will be like girl please I ain't go but it had been from like the in the morning time it would be like 45 to 50 degrees and then kind of warm up throughout the day but like today it was like in the 60s yesterday it was in the 60s but this is the first time I was able to pull out my boots because we've been having like 80 degree weather even though it's fall you know what I mean so I put on my boots I haven't worn them since last winter and um they zipped up like so easily it didn't even make sense you know what i mean like before i zipped them up but you know that last little piece when you got the fattest part of your calf you know you had to kind of put a little oomph on it i ain't had to do that yeah i just zipped them up really easy no problem so i can definitely see a difference a lot of my pants that even two months ago jeans i wore they're just really too big now they're sagging in the waist in the hips in the butt everywhere so i can definitely see a difference in my body so i think that i may be gaining some muscle um i haven't measured in a while but i can definitely tell my arms are getting smaller see i got this little shelf situation right here and the shelf has definitely got small <laughs> it definitely has um but i can see the difference so i'm not discouraged i think that kind of helps me because i can physically see a difference just looking in the mirror and then in my clothing so it's not like, oh, I ain't losing and wearing the same old stuff, you know what I mean? Um, so I'm pretty good on that front. I put on actually this tank top and leggings today so I could just kind of show you guys because I wasn't going to be a bucket naked for y'all on YouTube. Y'all, I won't scare nobody. <laughs> but just like so you can kind of see the difference. Now I did just eat, so don't be talking about my good. <laughs> I moved the camera down just a little bit. Um, just to see that I have been kind of losing inches. I can definitely tell the difference in my stomach um my chicken cutlets back here not as cutlety as they were before um i can just generally see a difference i think in my body are you nervous <laughs> so i'm not even mad um like i said because i can't see a difference but i feel good like i really do feel good um i've said this before i think in a couple of the videos that I'm really doing it the right way this time so it feels good you know what I mean um but yeah I didn't reach my goal but I ain't gang so I ain't mad um how you guys been doing I've seen a couple comments and I think I have one video for this last week um from Carol hey girl just um talking about you know how the challenge has been for you guys so far I hope it's been great I know that it's not always easy to keep track on these types of things because you know it can be out of sight out of mind you know what i mean um whenever you see a video maybe you'll think about it or whatever but like i said before i hope it could just kind of jump start you guys in whatever direction it is that you want to go i hope that i have been the least bit motivating or encouraging <laughs> to you guys because i know it gets hard it's hard hard and especially this month with thanksgiving coming up what dressing is really all i can think about dressing and pie sweet potato pie and dressing and i ain't even gonna front like i ain't never ate sweet potato pie and dressing on the same plate in one sitting because that's how i go down i mean really <laughs> but um so you know it gets really hard around the holidays and everything like that but i just hope that or pray that i could be the least bit helpful to anybody even just one of you guys even if i just got you thinking more about your health and reaching you know whatever fitness or weight loss goal or healthy eating goal or whatever your goal is um for october and beyond but um you guys let me know how you've been doing um was the challenge a fail did you see some progress and you feel good about it and you wish you could have done better you know let me know talk to me um i probably won't do another one until after the new year because i feel like i'm just kind of burning my channel out on flap to bad like that's all i've been doing mostly um and then i know a lot of people said new year's resolutions and all that kind of stuff so i think probably the first of the year i might do an another one and we'll kind of start over from there but um yeah like i said let me know how you guys have done 
what your progress has been has been good has been bad um i watched actually carol sent me a private video and she's lost some weight girl i think it was about eight pounds i don't remember the exact number but she lost some weight so thumbs up to her but um yeah you guys let me know what's been going on with you how's it been going you been good bad ugly whatever <laughs> um like i said just want to come in and check in let you guys know how october went for me um really looking forward to moving forward kind of nervous about thanksgiving i ain't gonna lie um really have to buckle down this month <laughs> but anyway i said i was gonna make it short and y'all know it's not but hope everybody's doing well um let me know below comments or video response how october was for y'all and i'll see you next time